Ashton, founder of Global Network for Justice and Humanity, Johanna Burus, joined in the call for immediate release of the leader of the Islamic movement in Nigeria, Ibrahim El Zakzaki, who is currently being detained by the Department of State Services. Buru, who was among other pastors that joined in the protest against Zagzaki's detention in Abuja, also accused the federal government of unlawfully detaining the religious leader. A correspondent, Basil Okafo, reports. In line with their vow to continue to protest until their leader is released from the custody of DSS, members of the Islamic movement in Nigeria are here again with their placards and banners calling for the release of Ibrahim Ezezaki. This time, a pastor and founder of Global Network for Justice and Humanity, Johanna Buru, is of the view that the continued detention of Zazaki by DSS is against his fundamental human rights. I'm here to support the free Zazaki that the federal government or the state or whosoever that is consigned should set this man free because Nigerian constitution says within 24 hours if one is found, if one is arrested, suspected or accused person should be tried. For three years he has been under detention. Nobody will condone that. And if there is justice in our country, they should, they should do that justice. So we want justice in favor of Malam and all his disciples, those who have been detained unlawfully or illegally. Attempt made by the Zazaki supporters to protest at the villa gate was denied by security operatives who stationed at the entrance. But members of the Islamic movement say they are also protesting over the alleged killing of their members by security operatives. The reason for this protest is nothing but the reason we have been protesting for more than 200 days here in Abuja. They have killed more than 1,000 people in Zaria. They have buried people to, alive. They have born people to death. They have missed Sheikh Zazaki inside his residence, kill his children before him, shoot his wife before him, shoot him and drag his bleeding body on top of the corpses of his children and brought him to Abuja. The shared followers further accused the authorities of unlawfully detaining Zazaki in violation of court judgment that ordered for his immediate release. Basil Okafo, Court TV News, Abuja.